Hi you guys, today, and I apologize about my hair, it looks pretty cute, but it's really messy, it's like 4.30 in the morning, I'm just really bored and wide awake, so I thought I'd do a YouTube video for you guys, and that is on the purple and black mixed smoke, smoky eye that I do on, on most occasions, I love the color purple, actually I'm wearing it right now, so, so my makeup will match what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, what we're going to do, and I apologize, you guys, I got shorts on, I know they don't match my whatever, but psh, whatever, you guys only really see from here up anyways, so it's all good. So what we're going to do, and I don't have to put my, my um, concealer or anything on right now because it's left on from earlier today. Well, actually, no, it's not because I washed my face. I'm just having a really good skin day, actually. Um, but I do still have some left under my eye from my eyeliner. That wiped off. <sighs> Alright, now my eyebrows, as you can tell, they are a little thinning. So what I do is I'll take a Q-tip, just a regular everyday Q-tip like this. I'll dip it in my black eyeshadow, which, not my jet black the lightest black that you have, so it's more like a brown, but it's darker than a brown. And I'll just go... And there, now my eyebrow is perfectly visible to everyone and it looks a lot better. So that's what I do for my eyebrows. Let me go ahead and do the other one. So there we go, now I've got better eyebrows, obviously, as you guys can tell. So that's what I do for my eyebrows. Now my smoky eye, I'll take my middle finger, and I'm going to put it in my... Okay, so as you guys can tell, I've got a lot of shades of purple. And as you can tell, this one down here is the darkest. That's the one you want to dip into. You want to get about that much on your fingers, not too much. Then you just rub it in on your lash, on your um, eyelid, I mean. Get it into the lash line as well. You want it all covered up. Boom, there's one eye. Boom, there's another. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to take a lighter, more kind of bluish purple. And you're going to take some of that and you're going to put it over it too. Just to give it a little more shade, not so, just to give it a little bit more depth. And you can mix any purples like, that you feel more comfortable with, that you like better on your skin. It's completely up to you. Um, I didn't get enough there. There we go. And then what I do, because I, I like using my fingers more than brushes. I know you see a lot of people using certain contouring brushes and eyeshadow brushes. And I just, I don't like them. I don't like them at all. But anyway, so I've got some baby wipes from Walmart. They're like 98 cents, this brand. I use them to clean my makeup off. And if I don't know what I'm going to do, I'm going to take one. Ah, I'm having a problem with it. Okay, so we're gonna take one. See this finger has got the stuff all over it. You're gonna wipe it off. So now your hand's clean. And you gotta dry your finger. You don't want to put a wet finger in your eyeshadow. It's gonna make whenever you put it onto your face, you're gonna get a big dark clump. That's gonna be really hard to work with. So now that we've done that, we're gonna take the purple again that I showed you, the really dark purple. Take that and we're going to put more on our finger this time. A lot more. It's a lot. It's a lot. And then you're going to work it in to your crease. And you go, you go whoosh, whoosh. And then you start here because you don't want too much here. So you start here and you start working it out. So it looks like that. And as you can tell, it's darker here than it is here. And that's what you're looking for in a smoky eye. Now, you do 
that with the other one. <clears throat> Then you're going to take a little bit of the black you used for um, your right here, which I used, oh, I'm sorry, it's this way. I used the one that, as you guys can tell, has a lot of makeup missing out of it because I use it a lot. It's this one right here. So this is the jet black, and then it gets a little lighter as you go up towards the grays. So anyways, you're going to take some black, not a whole lot, just a small amount. And you're going to dab it into this part right here. Dab it there. Then what you're going to do is you're going to work it in. You can work it all over. It doesn't matter if you get it up towards your eyebrow. It's perfectly fine. Just like that. There's that and then we'll of course do the other one boom there's most of it we're not done yet so then you take a light gold color because I think gold looks really good with pink or not pink a purple and black and you use it to fill in right under your see look at that it looks really nice because compared to this one if you guys can tell you feel that in da, 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 da. And then I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put some blush on. I'm gonna take this blush. It is natural by Happy Boosters. And my concealer brush or my blush brush, whatever you wanna call it, I don't care. It works for me, so whatever. I'm gonna put some blush on, especially since I have a dramatic eye. It brings more color to my face, especially since I'm using harsh colors like a dark purple and a dark black. Well, a lot. It's black. Whatever. It's black. Okay. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your um, liquid eyeliner pen. I'm gonna have to use my mirror for this. I'm sorry right across the lash line now you can do a cat eye or you go but I'm not going to today I just I'm not in the mood to deal with that but you can do it if you'd like it'll look really good uh, let me do the other one There's that. And then, of course, you know, you can put eyeliner underneath, which if I can find my eyeliner, I'll do. Here it is. Okay. Now, this, I'm using Elmay's Intense Eye Color. See, isn't that cute? It's like really cute. So you guys, I'm getting over a cold, so that's why my voice is a little different than my other videos, and I am sniffling and itching my nose and doing all that stuff, so sorry about that. I know it's not attractive. Sorry. I apologize again. <laughs> if I had editing software, I'd edit it out, but I don't. And in fact, people watching this, if you're using, uh, like, Autotone or, you know, any certain, uh, 
softwares to edit your videos, please let me know, you know, if they cost, where I can get them, because I'm very interested in getting better quality videos. Um, also doing music videos as opposed to just me singing. So let me know if you're watching this and you have any ideas for me. But that's my makeup. Hope you guys liked it. Here's a finished look. Now you can put mascara on, of course. I'm not going to mess with that because it is the middle of the night. I'm about to just take this right off. So anyways, thanks for watching.